Next week, the Fayetteville City Council will meet to decide if you'll be able to vote on Sunday alcohol sales in November. The City of Fayetteville is not the first one to put this up to a vote. KNWA's Kylie Neal worked today to find out how the approval of Sunday alcohol sales has impacted another Northwest Arkansas city. Kylie. The City of Rogers started Sunday alcohol sales in 2022. I spoke with Peter Masonis, who is the City of Rogers Public Relations Manager, about how Sunday alcohol sales have impacted the city. He says voters approved the initiative with a 70% approval rating. The City of Rogers approved alcohol sales on Sundays almost two years ago. Uh, by the time it was legal for residents to buy alcohol on Sundays in Rogers, it was January 2023. Since the addition of Sunday alcohol sales, Peter Masonis with the City of Rogers says the city has become more attractive to residents and tourists. He says this impacted the local businesses in Benton County and it created more opportunities for sales. We obviously sales tax is, you know, probably a hair up, um, but I think more importantly and more impactful would just be those small businesses that are actually selling those kinds of things. I mean, those are probably the most impacted folks. Springdale has allowed Sunday alcohol sales since 2012. Bentonville also passed it in 2022, leaving Fayetteville as the last major northwest Arkansas city to not allow the sales. Kara Ferguson is the general manager at Stadium Liquor in Fayetteville. She says she's ready for the November ballot. It will impact Fayetteville. It's going to be better for like the overall community. It's definitely going to keep our money in the Fayetteville city versus everyone driving out to Springdale or the two closest. Uh, from what I hear, the two closest is going to be Pandora's Bottle, Cheers. Ferguson says that she feels like she has missed out on business and that she can't imagine the foot traffic that the surrounding city liquor stores receive on Sundays. It's going to be nice to kind of spread out the revenue to more of like the Fayetteville stores so that way we're able to kind of catch up as far as business goes. But having this store closed is just more of an inconvenience for them and just most people of Fayetteville having to get up and drive to Springdale or if they're in Greenland having to drive clear across two towns to get just some beer. Sarah says that this is an exciting time for the city of Fayetteville. Residents and other people say that Sunday alcohol sales might be approved. Stadium liquor will be open on Sundays. Reporting in studio, Kylie Neal, KNWA, Northwest Arkansas News.